Autotrophs and Heterotrophs at the Maryland Zoo in Baltimore by Dylan Hager, Steve Martinez, and Daniel Charles. Heterotrophs are organisms that need to feed off other organisms. An example of a heterotroph is the giraffe which eats plants. An autotroph are organisms that create their own food. Plants are autotrophs because they make their own food through photosynthesis. Otters are heterotrophs. The North American river otter eats a variety of fish, shellfish, as well as small land mammals and birds. Maple trees are autotrophs. Like all plants, they make their own food by using sunlight. They are found in the northern hemisphere. Giraffes are heterotrophs. Giraffes eat plants like leaves and bushes. They are found in Africa. Flamingos are heterotrophs. They eat shrimp and algae. Flamingos can be found in the North and South America in Europe, Asia, and Africa. Ferns are autotrophs. Ferns make their own food by photosynthesis. The four places where ferns are most often found are in shady forests, rock faces, wetlands, and tropical forests. Penguins are heterotrophs. They eat fish, krill, and squid. They are found in Antarctica, Australia, South Africa, and South America. Native wild grass is an autotroph. Like all plants, they make their own food. Grasses are an important source of food for other organisms. Wolf spiders are heterotrophs. They eat, they eat insects like flies, crickets, and ladybugs. Wolf spiders are found all over the world. Crickets are heterotrophs. They eat rotting plant matter, but will eat fruit and tender leaves when given the chance. Crickets can be found almost everywhere on Earth, except in Antarctica. The Maryland Zoo in Baltimore is a great place to see hundreds of examples of autotrophs and heterotrophs.